In this time of uncertainty, a few entertainers have stepped forward to help out. The Angel tells us how her Angel Foundation is making a difference. Artists adding another dimension, another slash to the name. Uh, what's going on, the Angel? I'm good, I'm good. Foundation, good you. I, foundation, you got all these things. Foundation, I'm going to tell you about it because you have to plant it, you have to plant the seed, so you don't know, so I have to build the foundation. I started that foundation from five years ago, you know. Mm -hmm. So we start from Donga Grong Beso, come right up. What's the name of the foundation? The Ospil now, the Ospil now. <laughs> the foundation again, so the Ospil. What's Angels the... Foundation. Angels Foundation. Yes. And what, what is the foundation all about? It's actually for me, me and my son, giving back. So the foundation is geared towards helping um, the needy, like, uh, like the elderly and children. So. That's just basically what it's all about. But when we, in December, me and Marcadine started a drive because he actually sponsored an elderly just down the road from where I live. So every day when he comes from school, he's always like, save up lunch money and give the man and all these things. So we decided to just start back the foundation again. Yeah. So Marcadine prompted me to start it back again. And I said, you know what, how can I do it on a bigger scale now where I can reach more people? Mm -hmm. So I decided to keep a benefit concert. Wow. That's what I did. So, uh, obviously, in this whole COVID uh, times now, the Benefit Concert was at what? An online thing? Or yeah, what? yeah, right here, right here. I did the, um, right from the comfort of my home to your home, I did a Benefit Concert with myself, Beanie Man, singing melody, G Wiz, and Prince Bright, straight, of, straight out of Ghana, Africa. Wow. You understand? So, we had to mix it diverse. It was a great look. Um, a lot of persons donated. So, from that proceeds, you now I could actually turn up the scheme. Me, my mother, my sister, and of course we got help from the team. We, we stay up and we pack them up. Mother's Day, that's how I spent my Mother's Day and my mother, packing all care packages to let other people put a smile on their face. And um, we did 300 care packages, but what top it off now is the fact that Honeybun came on board and they, they come with them chuck and they stood by the park. So even when the food supplies is finished because we packed Honeybun, everybody got a Honeybun and one of my um, care package. Yeah. So it's two bags. So people are walking with two big bags. They are walking with. First, it's asking the angel when they come a Monday, but when they come a Mayfair, when they come a Clarinda, when they come a. It's just one me. It's just one me. So when I start this, persons will look at it now because you have other people out there that can donate to their community and their parish and which part them come from. So you're basically you're encouraging people to do it for their parish as well. Do it for your parish, yeah. yeah. Do it for your parish. <laughs> it's a new stage of your career? It's not a career, you know, I think it's a part of me. Angels Foundation is going to be a part of it for your lifetime. It's not like it's a career, it's just me giving back and just doing the right thing from my heart, you know? So the intense thing about my foundation, again, is the fact that I put smiles on people's face. People happy, people go home, people can go cook a food. One lady said to me, say, Angel, you know, long more by wanting a milk? Hmm. That's intense. That's a go on. <laughs> the angel living up to her name. Artist slash philanthropist. That's a go on. Big up. And so! <laughs> I didn't have to do that. Mad. Big up yourself, the angel.